Hi there, we're going to manually create a point. Um, in this instance, it's going to be at Snow Basin Resort in Utah. Um, you basically need three things to get this done. A, you need to know where you want your point to be. B, you need the draw toolbar. You can access this by right clicking in a gray area at the top of ARC and just choosing draw. Uh, and then you need to have the correct coordinate system set for your data frame. And by correct coordinate system, I just mean the one that you want to assign to this new uh, feature that you're going to create. This works for lines, points, polygons. Uh, we're just going to demonstrate digitizing a quick point or creating a quick point shape file, I should say. So for us, we want it to be in UTM zone 12, NAT 83. So that's that. And then using the draw toolbar, we can choose the marker tool, but this is what I mean by you can create um, polygons or lines. Uh, and then you're just going to click and place your point wherever you want it. Now this is just a drawing, so it has no spatial reference, so I can pick it up and move it. Um, that's a good thing to know and you can just delete it like you would um, any kind of drawing. Um, okay, and then to turn it into a, an actual shape file, we can convert the graphics to a feature. It opens a dialog box for us. We want to convert the point graphic. It gives you the option to select of uh, multiples. We want to borrow the coordinate system from the data frame. And we already checked to make sure that that's set the, to the right thing, so that works. And then um, I'm just going to change this to Snow Basin and spell it correctly. There we go. Um, OK, and then this, they also give you the option to delete the drawing when you convert it to um, the graphic after converting it to a shape file, and that just saves you a step later. So hit OK, and yes, I want to add it to the map. So it deleted the, the drawing. You see that the little um, hatch marks went away, and now I just have a legitimate shape file. If I go into the properties, um, it shows us that this isn't a graphic anymore. Um, it's a shape file feature class, point, geometry, and it's got coordinate values. Um, it also has an attribute table that we can start populating. So that's it.